What's going on everyone? I'm here to teach you guys how to get the newest update for Pure on the Seto Corso. I recently did a video on Pure 0.222 which did not have thunder um, and lightning. So the new version is out, the new uh, update is out uh, 0.250. So I'm going to teach you guys how to get that today. Before we get into the video, I want to thank everyone for blowing up that last video that I made on how to install pure plus rain that was my first how-to video honestly with that type of love you guys are giving me i'm gonna keep going let's get this one up and running and please don't forget to like and subscribe if you guys have any issues by the end of this videos let me know in the comment section i'm, I'm here almost instantly uh, i have this connected to my phone so i'm always responding and and helping out anyone that needs it all right let's get into this video so you guys are going to need content manager and custom shaders patch installed and if you guys don't have that go check out my um, video on how to install pure plus rain it goes through how to install content manager and custom shaders patch and the links are uh, down below in the description for that all right so once you guys are here again this is a dollar a month twelve dollars a year honestly with all his great work I can only imagine how long it takes them to do all this stuff, uh, but I would definitely support them. Now, I understand if you can't, um, you could pay a dollar for a month and cancel your sub. All right. So we're going to go down here. It's on top 0 0.250 and you go down here, show more. And if you guys have a good graphics card, go with the high res. If it's a decent graphics card, go with the low res. All right. So I already have mines downloading. So you guys are going to come hit this right here or the mega. It doesn't really matter. Um, so once you guys are here, hit download. Mine's downloading right here. Um, I'm doing this uh, with you guys. I actually got rid of my pure from content manager just so I could do it with you guys and show you exactly what to do. Um, it can get a bit confusing and um, I'm going to do my very best to explain it. So that way everyone has it. All right. Once the download is complete, go to downloads, open up pure 0.250. Minimize that, close that out. What I'd like to do is take uh, my downloads and put them onto a folder on my desktop because not all files show up in WinRAR had many cases. Uh, so I just played safe. So go to new folder and then drag the pure 0.250 into that new folder. All right, once that's done, you could close this out, open up the new folder, and there it is. So once you guys are here, this is the part that really confuses people. Um, what we have to do here is uninstall Soul and install Pure if you have Soul. Now, if you don't have Soul, all you're going to do is install Pure. All right, um, I'm going to go ahead and do install Pure. I deleted everything before the video just so I could do it with you guys. Once you guys are here. You're going to find your root uh, folder for a set of Corsa and the way you do that is you go to Steam, Library, a set of Corsa, right click, Properties, Installed Files, and then Browse. So here is your root um, folder for your uh, a set of Corsa. So once you guys are here, Go to your root folder for your set of Corsa. Program rooms, Steam, Steam apps, common, set of Corsa. Okay. And there you go. Install complete. Great. Close that out. Now we're going to go confirm if it worked. So open up your content manager, settings, custom shaders patch, weather effects, and then under weather style, you should see a, a pure 0 0.250. All right, that means we've done our job, we've installed it, we're good to go on to the next step. So you got your pure mod installed. The next thing we're gonna need is our preview version. And as you can see here, I have a paid version of 0 0.2.3 uh, custom shaders patch. All right, um, I believe Peter said you can use 0 0.2.0 for this mod, for the 0 0.250. Um, pure mod 
Um, so give that a try. I, I think I read it in his uh, description. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and stick with the 0 0.2.3 and I will teach you guys how to get that uh, also. Now if you guys decide to get the 0 0.2.3, I'm going to be showing you guys. You would go here. I will leave the link in the description once again. Uh, this is also a dollar a month. And once you're here, you hit control F, enter 0 0.2.3 and it'll be right there as you can see. And once you guys have that downloaded, I'll teach you guys how to get that into Content Manager. All right, so you guys got your preview version 0.2.3 downloaded. All you have to do for this one is drag and drop it into Content Manager, all right? You do that, you go to the top right and hit Install. So you guys will be able to see right here, it changed from 0.2.0 to 0.2.3 Preview 1. All right, the next thing you're gonna wanna do is come here under drive go to weather and make sure that pure is selected if it's not you won't be able to change the weather in the game a lot of people um said that they weren't able to change the weather due to this being grayed out make sure that both of these boxes the real conditions and idle conditions are unchecked if it's checked like so it will be grayed out you won't be able to change your weather so make sure those are unchecked go here go to pure and you should be good to go. All right, guys, here we are. I know you saw that lightning right there. So clearly it's working. I'm going to make sure it's working for you guys. So you're going to go up top to all apps. You're going to go under um, your apps and open up Pure Config and Pure Planner. All right, once you have these two things open, I want you guys to make sure that in Pure Config, go to Clouds and make sure that this is on one. It should be one by default, but just double check and make sure that's on one, okay? Go to shaders and right under here, this is all your uh, configuration for lightning and uh, thunder. So you'll be able to make it more uh, frequent, more brighter, uh, whatever you guys like, just they're self-explanatory so you guys could read through them, change whatever you guys like, and if you guys want to go back to default, just hit reset. And I'm sure you guys already know about this one. Over here, we could change weather to whatever you guys like, make it sunny, cloudy, storm, whatever you like. But for the purpose of this video, we're going to hit uh, heavy thunderstorms and see what it looks like. All right, you guys, before I put the volume up and let you guys hear this thing, um, I wanted to say thank you so much for checking me out. Please don't forget to subscribe. I stay uh, up to date when it comes to mods like this and anything that has to do with Assetto Corsa, the way it looks, thunder, rain, and, and the graphics. Um, as soon as I find something out, I make a video of it. So definitely subscribe if you guys want to stay on top of that. Um, any issues at all when it comes to uh, these mods, let me know in the comment section below and I will go um, figure that out for you guys. Alright, take it easy. Peace.